Welcome to BMW Today. My name is Joy and today's topic is colors and materials and with me is Stefan Böhm. Hi Stefan. Hello Joy. How are you doing? Uh, great, thank you. So what is your exact job in the company? At BMW Design, I take care of all the color and material issues from the 3 Series up to the 7 Series. Okay, so you're responsible for that beautiful color. That's right, thank you. How is it called? It's called Frozen Bluestone. Bluestone is a known color already. Yes, but we see this color for the first time on the 7 Series in okay. the Frozen version. Oh yeah, that's true. How does that work to get a high gloss color into a frozen, a matte finish color? We take the same color and then it's a different clear coat. So uh, this oh, okay. gives us the frozen uh, look for this. And why do you choose certain colors to get into the frozen version? We always look which color does fit best to the car from a design point of view. Okay. And Bluestone is one of them. I like that contrast in the front with the kidney and the matte finish of the car. And I see a contrast in the inside as well. That's right, that's a brand new upholstery. It's called Smoke White Night Blue. And uh, it's never been seen before in a 7 Series like this. Looks really impressive. Let's have a closer look at that. Wow, that looks really impressive. So tell me a little bit more about the interior. Yeah, the smoke white and night blue theme is a theme for the whole interior, from the dashboard to the headliners and also for the doors. And with a new two-tone optic, we could do some highlights on surfaces and lines. Well, yeah, the lower part here in the door is highlighted with the blue. That reminds me a little bit of the Nauta Swan edition a few yeah, years back. That was the inspiration for that. We ah. had the chance to, to create a really wonderful car for the uh, Nauta Swan company. And uh, now we achieved to bring this into the series. You have a really nice blue carpet and even the roof is in blue. Yes. That's very cool. I've heard some news about the X-Series as well. Can we talk about that? We can talk and we, I can show you a wonderful edition. Stefan, I can see the matte finish on the wheels as well. Yes, also this 22-inch wheels do get the matte-like version as well for this car. Very cool. This car, is this a special edition? This car is the special edition called Dark Shadow. Dark Shadow. What was the idea behind that? Did you wake up and you thought like, hmm, a dark or a matte finish X7 would look nice? Uh, it was not exactly like that, but <laughs> uh, it's coming close because we uh, all know the X7 as a very elegant car. And with an M Sport package, it gets much more sporty and muscular. But we wanted to focus with color and material on the dark side. Okay. So is the Dark Shadow Edition limited to a number? It's only 500. Guys, 500 cars only worldwide, so you have to hurry up. Thank you for your time, Stefan. Hope My to pleasure. see you soon again. And we have one more car, the 8 Series, and therefore we have Dino Mehrmann with me. Hi, Dino. How are you doing? Hi, Joy. I'm doing well. You? Good. What is your job? I'm in the design department and I'm responsible for the M cars and the individual cars. Okay, very cool. Regarding to color and trim. Okay, interesting. So tell me a little bit about this car. This is the M850 Special Edition Golden Thunder. This car was a special market requirement. Mm -hmm. The market wanted us to do a car which has uh, this luxury appeal but still looking subtle, evil and sporty. Okay. And for the customers who really want to have something very expressive. Okay, very interesting. So therefore, you chose the frozen black color. Yes. yes. Is there another possibility for the customer? Yes, you can have this uh, color combination in frozen black, as you can see here now mm -hmm. on the Ford or Grand, Grand Coupe. Mm -hmm. You can have this color too in black sapphire glossy okay. with the golden striping. Okay. And you can have this car as a coupe mm -hmm. and a convertible. Okay, so all three derivates? Yes. But always black yes. and gold. Black and gold. Why those two colors? We think uh, it's just a matter of looks. We think the car looks stunning as is. And with the golden striping, it gets this car a luxury appeal because in the European and American markets, mm -hmm. these color combinations seem to never run out of style yeah. and uh, they really look awesome, that's what we think. Well, yeah, I, I think also that black cars always look classic. Yeah, it's classic, yeah. very classic. Why did you choose this gold tone, one yeah. other another? Because we liked it the most, that's for <laughs> sure. Okay. And the other thing is, uh, you, in the exterior of a car, you have many of sensors and on the sensoring on the car, mm -hmm. colors could affect the sensing oh, yeah. properties 
of the car and uh, we don't want to have that so it has to go through certain tests and this color was also tested positively okay. not to harm the sensing of the car. So you only have technical boundaries? Techn only. It's okay, very cool. Is this theme also visible inside? Yes. Yeah, let's have a look. Yeah. So what do we have? We have a black leather upholstery. We have got the golden stitch yeah, on I'll, the headrest. I'll take a seat. Okay, wow. And we have the golden anodized trim panels in the middle console, uh, front and rear. That's really cool. What about the rear? What do we see there? Yeah, we have got the striping on the exterior. Mm -hmm. And we, uh, if you follow me around the car, as you can see, the stripe follows from the side of the car to the rear and makes it a complete thing. Uh, we think that makes the car look even wider and lower. Mm -hmm. I like that. And also, this is real paint, right? Yes, that's, that's the thing we are very proud of in the design department because normally on these cars you find a foil or something like that mm -hmm. in the exterior. But in this particular case, this is really painted to the car, so it makes it a whole thing in our, in our regard. And I've heard something is hidden in the trunk as well. So let's have a look. Of course, two trolleys, one in black and the other one in the expressive golden color with the black M logo. So thank you very much for your time, Dino. Hope thank to you see you soon again. And you guys, thanks for watching BMW Today.